Sai Ram devotees, welcome to Launchbox Sai Center's online satsang. Many of us are here today because we love ourselves enough to want to achieve our highest potential, to realize that we are God. Baba has given us one such method to help in this realization and that is a below affirmation. I am God. I am God. I am no different from God. I am the eternal, undifferentiated, absolute. Grief and anxiety cannot affect me. I am always content. Fear cannot enter me. I am such it ananda. I am pure existence, awareness, and bliss. I am omnipotent. I am all-powerful. Nothing is impossible for me. I am omniscient. I am all-knowing. There is nothing which is not known to me. I am omnipresent. I am present everywhere. I pervade this universe. I am Krishna, I am Buddha, I am Jesus. I am Sai, I am Sai, I am Sai. I am God, I am God, I am God. Before we begin our satsang, let us also set our intention for today's satsang and for life. I intend to realize that I am God, that we are all God. Let us now begin with our opening prayer. Oh, 
ಸವಿತು ವರೇಣ್ಯಂ ವರ್ಗೋ ದೇವಸ್ಯೀಮಹಿ ಧೀಯೋ ಯೋ ನ ಪ್ರಚೋದಯ ಭೂರ್ಭುವಸ್ತು ತತ್ಸವಿತು ವರೇಣ್ಯಂ ವರ್ಗೋ ದೇವಸ್ಯೀಮಹಿ ಧೀಯೋ ಯೋ ನ ಪ್ರಚೋದಯ ತತ್ಸವಿತು ವರೇಣ್ಯಂ ವರ್ಗೋ ದೇವಸ್ಯೀಮಹಿ ಧೀಯೋ ಯೋ ನ ಪ್ರಚೋದಯ Please sit up straight and in the quietness of your mind hear the sound of your breathing breathe in and out in out as you breathe in let your mind say so as you breathe out let your mind say hum so hum so see the light in front of you this is the light of a candle gaze intently at the light now feel the light shining in the center of your forehead now half close your eyes and feel the light in the center of your forehead let that light come down down your neck to the center of your chest imagine a flower a lotus opening petal by petal to receive the light now the light is resting on the lotus the lotus disappears only the light remains but it is no more the light of the candle it is a round ball of formless light it is a light of divinity within you feel this light now expand and feel the light going down down your body into your legs up to your feet feel warmth as the light surges through your limbs and make this mental vow o lord my legs touched by the light of your divinity will always take me only to places of goodness feel the light surging upwards up into your chest around your shoulders and down into your arms and fingers feel the warmth as this light surges through you make this mental vow o lord my arms touched by the light of your divinity will only yearn to do what is good now feel the light surging upwards into your neck and into your face into your head and the light now shines in your eyes kavao my eyes must yearn to see only what is good 
Feel the light now shining in your ears. My ears must yearn to hear only what is good. Feel the light now shining on your lips. My lips must yearn to only speak what is good. Now, feel this light now shining into your whole body. The light illumines the body. In your mind, repeat the words, the light is in me. Now feel the light expand. Expand and you are now sitting in a ball of light, in a cone of formless light. Let your mind say, the light is within me. I am in the light. Feel a thrill of this light and now feel this light expanding expanding and filling this entire room with a divine glow and let this light now go beyond this room beyond and beyond spreading ever further to this whole country and beyond this country beyond oceans and beyond nations let this light flow ever outwards to encompass the whole world. Now, imagine yourself, not your physical body, but an inner being within you, like a gigantic divine form, sitting on the globe, and the light of your divinity, the light of your love, encompassing the whole world. Stay for a moment, thrilled in that thought. Feel oneness with the whole world. Feel at peace with yourself. And now, look inside you. Can you imagine do you see a ball of light within you? In this ball of light, bring in the form of the Ishta Deva, the divine being that you love and worship, be it the Christ, Rama, Krishna, Buddha, or Bhagavan Sri Satya Sai Baba. See this form smiling within you. See this divine form raise his hands in blessing. Now, receive the blessing and darshan of the divine, the divine within. Stay for a moment, thrilled in this thought that you and he are one. Be your own judge. Coach, how should I perform? You said I should always tackle as a center field player and pass the ball quickly. But my father says I should always dribble and score a goal. I'm confused. What should I do? Mike, so what should you do? Who is the most important person for you in a game? Have you asked your mind this question? Leo for sure knows a story for this. Once, a man, his son and a donkey were traveling. As they were passing through a village, they were both sitting on the donkey. Oh, what is the poor donkey fur but to ride upon? 
Listening to their comments, the father got down from the donkey and walked along beside them. This lazy lad has no respect. He lets his father walk while he rides on the donkey. So the father ordered the son to get off the donkey and he himself got onto the donkey. Shame on these two for troubling the poor donkey. Now the father and son picked up the donkey and carried it. But soon they saw that all the locals were laughing at them. If you try to please everyone, you will please no one. That's what exactly the father and son in the story did and became the laughing stock. So, listen to every piece of advice but ask yourself how you should behave and then decide. You are the best judge in any given situation you are in. the beautiful online satsang. I thank you for joining with us as we help each other along our spiritual journeys back to Godhead. Until we meet again, I encourage you all to live in love. Make decisions based on love and allow your divine light to shine and inspire all those around you. Sai Ram. Mm -hmm.